Hi, I'm here to talk to you about a company called Cerul. Cerul has developed a range of cutting edge nutritional products that address the three most important areas of health, and that is stem cells, inflammation, and circulation. Now we're gonna start off with the stem cells first because that's a very important area here. And the stem cell message is in fact very simple. Stem cells are your body's own repair system. And the more stem cells you have, the more repair your body can do. And of course, the more repair your body does, the healthier you become. And we at Cerul have a plant-based product that's clinically proven to increase your own adult stem cells. So how do stem cells repair? First of all, every tissue in your body has a limited lifespan. Your eyes, your liver, your heart, your brain, your kidneys, your lungs, your muscles, your cartilage, all of those different cells have a different lifespan. Now, when those cells become damaged or when they come to the end of their lifespan, they send a signal to the bone marrow. The bone marrow then releases these stem cells that go through circulation. They migrate into, into the other cells and tissue of the body, and then they turn into brand new cells of that type. So whether you drop a brick on your toe, those damaged cells send a signal to the bone marrow, bone marrow releases the stem cells, they then go to your toe and they become new skin cells, blood vessel cells, nerve cells, ligaments, tendons, whatever your body needs to do the repair. So each of our organs and tissues in the body has that turnover. So what happens is that every five days you have a new intestinal lining. Every three to five years you have a new pancreas and a new liver. Every four to five years you've got a new lungs and every 15 to 20 years you have a new heart. So this is the body's own repair system. This is what's happening on a day-to-day -day basis. Now, why would we look at wanting to take a stem cell nutrition product if our body is actually repairing itself all the time? Well, it's things like aging. As we age, the numbers of circulating stem cells decline. As a baby, we've got a 100% release rate of stem cells. And that's how we grow from a baby into an adult. But as we age and we get up to about the age of 20 to 25 years old, our body stops growing and our body then starts going into the maintenance program of having cells die off and cells be replaced. So this is where we get the tissue turnover and our organs regenerating. But as we age, the numbers of circulating stem cells drops. And by the time we're 50 years old, we only have 50% of the circulating stem cells we had when we were t when we were a baby. When we're 65, we've only got 10% because that release rate drops by 90%. So that means that in prime health, if we're getting a new liver and new pancreas every three to five years, and then all of a sudden, well, not all of a sudden, but over many, many decades, our release rate goes down to 90%, that means it's gonna take 10 times the amount of time to actually regenerate that tissue in the body. So as we, um, as we age, our stem cells decline. Other things reduce the stem cell release as well, things like stress, emotional, physical stress on your body, poor sleep, toxins, poor diet, too much or too little exercise and illness itself can also decrease the amount of circulating stem cells. And what happens when we've got less stem cells? Our bodies do less repair. You know, macular degeneration. We don't get macular degeneration through the loss of eye cells because everybody's losing those cells. We don't get Parkinson's through the loss of brain cells because everybody's losing those brain cells. We don't get diabetes or multiple sclerosis through the loss of pancreatic cells or um, myelin sheath cells. We get those diseases and those illnesses because those cells aren't being replaced when they die. And in fact, some researchers 
went out and they tested the circulating stem cells of people with macular degeneration, Parkinson's, diabetes, heart disease, multiple sclerosis, etc. And then they measured the group of healthy people with no illness. And what they found was the people that did have an illness only had about 50% or less of the circulating stem cells of a healthy person. So if you have you know, if you've got an illness or a condition, then that means that you don't have enough stem cells in your body to maintain a optimal level of health and your body is deteriorating faster than it can repair. So here we have Stem Enhance Ultra. It's a plant-based product that helps to increase your circulating stem cells by 34% within 60 minutes. So every time you take two capsules, 60 minutes later, you've got an average of 34% stem cell increase. And as we have seen, stem cells can become heart cells, kidney, cartilage cells, lung, brain, eye, pancreatic, liver, muscle cells. And when those stem cells turn into these other cells, you get better of whatever that organ or whatever that type of cell does. You know, stem cells can't turn into T3, T4 hormones. They can't turn into dopamine in the brain. They can't turn into insulin. But they can turn into tissue that create those hormones within the body. So it's really a, um, really a deep feeling of wellness. Once your body starts to cellular regenerate, then as those hormones start working at the right levels, then that's when that really deep feeling of wellness comes on because everything starts to be balanced out. So what's the difference between cellular nutrition versus stem cell nutrition? Cellular nutrition is all the food we eat, the water we drink, the air we breathe, which you know, we have to have that. But it's sort of like having your back lawn. You know, you feed your lawn, you fertilize it, you aerate it, you water it, and you've got a beautiful lawn out there. But then one day you wake up and there's a dead patch. You know, no matter how much fertilizer, no matter how much water you put on there, no matter how much you aerate it, you need new seed. And stem cell nutrition is just that. It's the new seed that helps your body to regenerate itself. So that's what sets that apart. Normal nutrition is for existing cells and stem cell nutrition supports the replacement of dying or damaged cells. Because after all, everybody wants to sleep better, wake feeling refreshed, better mental clarity, feel more energized, they wanna exercise better because you don't need to be sick to benefit from stem cell nutrition. Everybody's got millions of cells dying off every single day. And if we can replace those cells at a higher level, then our body remains functioning at a higher level. So that's really where stem cell nutrition is ultimately a key to better health. Now, supporting other products that we've got um, for inflammation, we have Cyactive and Cyactive Joint. Now, these help with two different levels of inflammation they reduce local inflammation and they balance whole body inflammation and they help with joint pain and mobility so we'll have a look at cyactive first cyactive is about whole body inflammation i like to talk about the itises colitis sinusitis bronchitis cellulitis all of these things with itis on the end are things that are coming from systemic inflammation through your whole body. Cyactive joint is just that. It helps with the inflammation of the joints, the inflammation of the um, mobility of the body. So it helps to calm all of that down. Then we have plasma flow for circulation. It improves circulation, reduces oxidative stress, and reduces fibrin and debris within the blood vessels. It helps with blood vessel integrity. So this is where, in this middle part here, this is where oxygen comes in, carbon dioxide goes out. 
where nutrients go in, where waste goes out. Where stem cells go in, where dying cells come out. So this is a really important part of the whole blood system within the body. Now, that part in here can actually get blocked up with a bit of this fibrin. And by the time we're 29 years old, we all have significant fibrin levels. So already at 29, we're starting to show a decrease in the circulatory system in these very fine capillaries. And plasma flow helps to clear that out. So stem cell repair. Here's a picture of a mouse that had a that was radiated to kill off all of its own stem cells. It was then injected into the bone marrow with one fluorescent tagged stem cell. And so all of the daughter cells from that cell would be fluorescent. So day to day, we've got, this is a, a picture of its leg. So day to day, you've got cells that die off and then cells that be replaced. This is happening in every tissue in your body. Cells die off, cells get replaced. And through this fluorescent marker, we can actually see that now. So that's normal daily repair. Now, the mouse had an injury caused to the tibialis muscle. And so when an injury happened, as you can see, more stem cells went to the area to do more repair. So that's pretty amazing. That's how the body works. If you get injured, that's where your stem cells go to to repair that injury. Now, if you're actually able to physically increase the amount of those circulating stem cells. This is a picture of a mouse that had stem enhance ultra, which then caused a massive release of stem cells. And then you had more stem cells going to the area. So then ultimately you had more repair in the body. So here's a few people that we're talking about. Lady here with macular degeneration. The cells are dying off in the eye. Two capsules twice a day over four months, her stem cells went to her eye and became brand new eye cells, and her vision returned, and she was able to read under normal light. This here is an 81-year-old gentleman back in 2011. Um, he was getting ready for a knee replacement. He had no cartilage in his knee here, and his bone density was quite poor. It's sort of like quite sort of gray in this area. And as we can see down here, this white line is the cartilage that's grown back into his knee and then his bone density as you can see here is quite a bit whiter which means that it's um, harder to see through for the x-ray so he grew his cartilage back his bone density improved and he no longer needed a um, knee replacement this is a personal friend of mine Heiko he had a um, an attack of the shingles went into his eye he was very concerned because the doctor said he might go blind. Um, 14 days after the onset, he had these big sort of scab things going on, um, blisters and all that sort of thing. And he was really worried because it didn't feel like he was getting any better. But then he started some stem enhance. And just 13 days after stem enhance, everything had cleared up. He was also saying his nails were feeling stronger. Um, his flexibility had increased, his hair was starting to grow thicker than it had before. Um, so yeah, very, very impressed with what was going on. And here's someone here who, who started on the products, they had this ulcer for about 18 months. And as you can see here, the white tissue around there, no blood flow or very, very poor blood flow. So where there's poor blood flow, there's no stem cells getting to the area. So this person took the plasma flow and the stem enhance ultra and the plasma flow cleaned out all that inflammation in the blood vessels all that fibrin so the circulation became better then the stem cells could get to that area and they started to do the repair work and that's just 15 days later um, very much on its way to healing and then this is where we'd normally do some testimonials um, in a live meeting um, so what we're finding is that most people do really well on two capsules twice a day. If you've got a bit more going on than the average person, then you can go on to you know, three capsules twice a day. And if you're really unwell, 
you know, you've got some pretty serious stuff going on, you can do three to four capsules three times a day. Um, Cyactive, we find that one capsule twice a day um, is quite good, and Plasma Flow, two capsules per day um, is, is very good as well. So Stem Enhance Ultra is beyond any supplement you've ever tried. It really does change things. All the supplements you've had to date have been feeding, nourishing, and protecting the existing cells of the body. But until you've tried Stem Enhance, you haven't actually used anything that can actually help to regenerate the tissue within the body. So that's what Stem Enhance is all about. And just one disclaimer is that our products do not treat, cure, diagnose, or help with any medical condition. The only thing that Stem Enhance Ultra does is to support the release of stem cells from the bone marrow into circulation. So that's us for tonight. Thank you very much.